Today I'm unboxing the Nike Sport Loop. It's the 41mm for my smaller Apple Watch. As you can see here, I've just got a normal brown parcel, right? But then I noticed it had this arrow on it and I knew it was from Apple. As a delivery man, you must be able to notice what's an Apple parcel and what's not an Apple parcel. Anyway, let's get into the unboxing. So, this right here is the Nike Sport Loop for the 41mm Apple Watch. It's in one of my favourite colours, which is black. I've been waiting for this Nike Sport Loop to arrive for some time. There were some postal delays in my area and it's finally arrived. I'm very tanned because I just got back from holiday and I was meaning to take this with me on the trip but sadly I couldn't make it. What I also have is a replacement Apple Watch because my smaller Apple Watch broke for some reason the screen stopped working properly. Thankfully it's covered under Apple's warranty program so I sent it in for a new one and the new one came in this nice small packaging over here. I'm going to unbox the Nike Sport Loop and then I'm going to unbox my replacement Apple Watch and I'm going to try it on for the first time. They're both brand new so it's, it's kind of like a new unboxing except they've come in two separate packages. Let's start with with the Sport Loop. Oh my gosh. This looks so nice because it's so much fresher than my other one. There we go. Really cool. Now, let me show you my other Sport Loop, which I've been wearing for a few months now, and I wonder if you can tell the difference between like how much wear and tear there is. Here it is over here on the bigger Apple Watch. I feel like this one's a bit whiter than this one, just from just from how much it's been used. Yeah. I mean like, it's ever so slightly brighter just from standard wear and tear, but I'm surprised because of the bigger Sport Loop has actually held up pretty well. It looks really good. It's not like it's, it's frayed anywhere or there's any noticeable stretching. It's not even like the Velcro has gone all furry from where it's been like hook and close so many times. It's actually still quite crisp. So I'm quite impressed with that on my bigger Apple Watch. Now I'm gonna put the big Apple Watch to one side, bring back the sport loop, and we're gonna unbox the smaller Apple Watch over here. Let's just open it like this. This is my favorite watch strap on my favorite color Apple Watch. The only difference between them is the two sizes. I found that I was wearing the bigger size more than the smaller size because of how comfortable the strap was, even though I know the smaller size fits my wrist better. It's for that reason I decided to buy another Velcro strap. In fact, the exact same one because I really like the black Nike Sport Loop. Call me crazy, but I'm rocking two of the same straps with two of the same years Apple Watches. You might be thinking, surely Saf, you wanna mix up the straps, but no, I bought two of them, and there's a very good reason why. In fact, there are a number of really good reasons why, and I will link that video up above as soon as it's ready. 